Hey, hello, welcome, welcome back to some training. Today we're gonna do some pedal techniques. Pedal techniques. And uh, it's about the way you activate your muscles in different areas around your pedaling. So, for those that want to warm up for 10 minutes, let's start going. And then those that just want to pause it and come back later, that's fine. You can warm up 10 minutes, 5 minutes. If you want to do an extended warm up, that's okay. We're just doing a half an hour training today, 30, 30 minutes for pedal techniques. We're going to start by your normal warm up. We're going to do a one minute fast pedal. Then we're going to do a one minute endurance maximum power wattage. We're going to do a second one minute power endurance and then if you know your figures already that's great otherwise take your calculator take your max wattage take your max effort that you've put in today and work out 60 percent of that 0 0.6 60 percent of your maximum wattage and then we're going to do some pedal techniques working at 60 percent of your effort okay it's a six out of ten rate so many times uh, you've trained during the week you've ridden and you're feeling a little tired and you just seem to be not getting better you're sort of in pain the whole time or not uh, sticking with the group it's a good idea to take a day off maybe take two days off maybe take a week off another way is to just take an easy day and work on some technique so today we're going to work on pedal techniques and i'm going to explain to you exactly what i mean with that and then we'll get going so while well, i'm just setting up the gears here uh, you can set up your waters and whatever you want to drink or eat and i'm going to take the camera off from the top in front of me and i'm going to put it next to me so that you can understand and see my explanation so don't worry the camera is not falling I'm just moving it so that you can get a view of where my feet are all right so you should be able to get a nice view of my pedaling okay that's it both in front and at the back okay so if you take your pedal and we start at the top and let's just say for argument's sake this is 12 o'clock if i'm pushing it forward and i stop there it should be around about three o'clock if i bring it down all the way to the bottom should be about six o'clock and bringing it back up to the middle sort of in the center nine o'clock so i'm working this circle and i'm breaking it up into these positions as you would look onto a clock so we're going to start off our training today at the bottom if this is three o'clock then from four o'clock you want to start scraping uh, you want to pull your heel out of your shoe you want to pull it back you want that hamstring to work you'll feel it a little bit in the knee you're going to pull back four o'clock five o'clock six o'clock seven o'clock that's your working position scraping four five six seven scraping at the bottom pull that leg back scrape it back okay then from that position seven o'clock you're going to start pulling up pulling up eight o'clock nine o'clock ten o'clock eleven so that's your second that second position you're working with is pulling up from seven eight nine ten eleven pulling up pulling up seven eight nine ten eleven then you're going to go over the top from the one o'clock position you're working down pushing one o'clock two three four pushing 
you can even drop the heel a little but you're pushing down from one two three four one two three four o'clock okay so those are the areas that we're going to concentrate on during the training today okay so there we go all back in into the video into the frame okay let me just set you up there all right so you continued pedaling hopefully you've warmed up we've just uh, gone over about three and a half minutes of uh, the warm-up maybe you've warmed up a little bit longer already so let me explain it from this position now so when we're going to scrape the foot at the bottom you want the left leg and the right leg to work together you want them to help each other so you're going to have the one leg scrape then the other leg scrape one leg scrape the other leg scrape get that foot to stray back from four o'clock five six seven pulling it at the bottom that's going to be our first technique of scraping then as you pull it up i don't want you to pull from the knees don't pull from the knees i want you to work these muscles up here in the hip you want to pull it up from here pull up pull up pull up pull up pull up from the seven o'clock position eight nine ten eleven pulling it up and i want you to focus on these muscles here you can tighten up the stomach as you pull it up pull up pull up pull up then as we get along further the third set or the third exercise technique is going to push down using these big quadricep muscles you've got these strong muscles i'm going to push down push 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 all right and then from that position we're going to come up you're going to stand you're not going to change the gear because you're ready at a 60 percent effort you're working at a 60 percent effort of your max today and your cadence you're going to be keeping it below 90 rpm below 90 cadence today 85 to 90 cadence rpm today so you're going to come up and you're going to work that circle pushing pulling scraping working those two legs together okay you can do it i know you can do it no change in the gear but you're going to stay at that 60 percent effort level that you were when you were sitting down okay then coming back down you're going to stick with that you're going to work big circles big circles work big circles let the right leg and the left leg help each other working that big circle over the top pushing down pulling through pulling up pushing over pulling through scraping pulling up and we're going to work those big circles together all right so we've got about four minutes four minutes to go one fast pedal one power endurance second power endurance and then we'll get into the routine we'll probably do about three sets it's just half an hour workout here we go we've got six and a half minutes down and make sure you're drinking some water and uh, getting something to eat before we start okay i hope that's covered everything that uh, you need to know beforehand if you haven't got that calculator with you or you know your values already that's fine but we're going to work on your maximum endurance power wattage for today and then work out 60 percent of that and we're going to work that one minute at a time one minute at a time okay Okay, I'm going to drink something so long so that you're hydrated before we start. And as I said, this is a good exercise for when you're not feeling that great during the day. If you focus on these techniques, 
you're able to isolate different muscles when you get tired so you might feel oh I can't keep up with this bunch just activate a different muscle and see how well you do this is excellent Nice easy gear, you're not working on power here. Bring up the speed, bring up that leg speed, get the cadence up, bring it up. Just fast pedal, activate those muscles, activate those energy systems, get that oxygen to flow, get that blood moving. Okay, 20 seconds. Ten. Five. And slow it down. Slow it down. Good work. So that was one minute fast pedal. Okay. After this, we're only resting for one minute. Only resting for one minute. You're gonna go into your max power endurance for today. Remember, it takes about 10 seconds, maybe 15 seconds to get your set, get the right gear, to be able to maintain that power. You wanna maintain that power. You actually wanna go up with your power on the last second. You don't want to come back down and lose it. Alright, make sure you're in the big chain ring. Getting ready for that maximum power output. Five seconds to go. And click it down, one gear down. Get your RPM above 90 for this. Click it down, your RPM above 90. Take it to 95, 95 to 100. Bring it up. Okay, you should have it. You should have your max power for endurance for one minute. Keep your cadence, keep it constant. Ten seconds, five, two, one, relax, make it easier, easy on the gear. Okay, remember that power, remember that effort you put out. We have the indication. And the equipment remember that value if you don't just remember that perceived energy if you could maintain it if you could keep it okay 30 seconds to rest though now we're going to do it again and you're going to compare the two the two values the two efforts to make sure 
you've got a medium or a middle value for your power wattage. Okay, yeah, 10 seconds. Five. Right, ready? Click it down. Speed up that cadence. Click it down. Make sure your cadence is up. Click it down. Make sure you got it. You can maintain it. Click it down. Keep that resistance. Keep that cadence. Thirty seconds. Ten seconds. And bring it down. Easy ride, easy gear, good work. Remember that value. Okay. So, I'm gonna have a three minute rest. And then we're gonna start the exercise. Okay, I'm gonna drink something, and then work out the values. Okay, take your power wattage and that you generated, times it by 0.6, so you have 60% of your value. So, for instance, if you did 400 watts times 0.6 equals 240. So you want to cycle this whole exercise at a wattage of 240. You want to bring your cadence down below 90, between 85 and 90 at a 60% effort. All right, so you should have your value. You should know what you're riding at. We've got a minute and 15 still to rest and relax before we get going. Make sure if you can bring up your cadence to 90 already so that your pedal speed is faster. You should bring up your resistance so you're just at the 50% level of your max. Okay, last minute to rest, then we're going to start the whole sequence. We're going to start scraping on both sides, focus on the scraping for one minute. Then we're going to pull up using these muscles, pulling up, keeping the core tight, the stomach in for one minute. And we're going to push down push down for one minute you can drop the heel if you want to just focus on that muscle you don't have to over emphasize it even if you just focus on that muscle you're gonna see it's gonna work okay let's start find your 60 percent bring your cadence up Doing about 90, 85 to 90, scrape it through. Scrape, 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 scrape. Think about it. Think about it. Scrape, scrape. Excellent. Scrape. Scrape, 
keep it at 90 85 rpm 60 percent effort six out of ten scrape scrape okay five seconds to go now start pulling pull 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 keep the core tight the stomach tight work these muscles pull 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 keeping that rpm keeping that wattage pull focus pull that muscle pull 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 that's good 20 seconds to go keep the core tight pull pull okay five seconds to go push 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 Okay, bring the heel down maybe. Push. Keep that RPM. Keep that wattage. Push. Push. That's it. Good. Just think about it. Push. Push. Twenty seconds to go. Twenty. Push. Focus. Okay, get ready to stand up. And stand up. Keep that resistance. Don't change it. Okay, big circle. Work the circle, pushing down, scraping, pulling up, all together in one. Okay, 30 seconds. Work together. Let the left leg help the right leg. Ten seconds. Five. And sit down. Big circle. Big circle. Big circle. Scraping. Pulling up. Pushing down, left leg, right leg, helping each other. Big circle, big circle, big circle. Work together. Let the left leg help the right leg. Let the right leg help the left leg. Okay, 20 seconds to go. Work together. Work together. Big circle. Five seconds. And slow it down. Don't change the gear. Just slow it down. Relax. Resting for one minute. Okay, if you want to drink something. 30 seconds and we start it all over again. Okay gonna go a lot better now 20 seconds 
You're gonna scrape, scrape. 10 seconds to go. Five seconds. Okay, bring up that cadence. Bring up the wattage. Here we go, scrape. Pull it back, pull it back. Scrape it, scrape it. Pull it back. You're working only at 60%, but focus on that muscle. Scrape, scrape. Pull it back, pull it back. That's it. From the four o'clock to the seven o'clock. Scrape. Scrape. Four o'clock to seven o'clock. Okay, ten seconds to go. Ten seconds. Five. Get ready. Pull it up. Pull it up. Pull it up. Pull it up. From the 7 to the 11 o'clock position, pull it up, focus on these muscles, focus on these muscles, keep the core tight, stomach in, pull it up, pull it up. Keep that cadence. That's it, keep it there, keep it there. Pull it up, pull it up. Ten seconds. Five. And push down, push down, push down. Push down. Keep that cadence. Keep that cadence. 85 to 90. You're keeping a 60% effort. Push. Push. Bring that heel down maybe. Push. Push. 30 seconds. Fifteen. Five seconds. Get ready to stand up. <coughs> and stand up. Circle. Big circle. Work it. Big circle. Push down. Scrape. Pull up. Big circle. Let the left leg help the right leg. Let the right leg help the left leg. Okay, 30 seconds to go. And 20 seconds. Five. And bring it down. Big circle. Big circle. Let those legs work together. Big circle all the way around. To the top, to the bottom. To the extremities on the outside. Keep that cadence. Big circle. 30 seconds, work it, big circle, with one leg help the other leg, scrape, pull up, 
push down. Ten seconds to go. Five. And slow it down, relax the muscles. Okay, we've got two minutes to rest. Two minutes. Then we do the third set. Okay, this is an excellent workout. It activates those different muscles. Helps you to focus and concentrate on those different muscles. Different pedaling technique. When you're in a bunch, when you're riding behind a wheel, somebody tries to drop you, you're trying to get away. This is excellent. You work those big circles, you can push down, you can pull back, you can think of them, and you'll activate those muscles. Okay, last 30 seconds. Okay, focus, this is the last set. 15 seconds to go. Five seconds. And bring up the cadence, get your watch it right, start scraping. Scrape, scrape, scrape it, scrape it back. Focus on those muscles. You're between 85 and 90 RPM. Sitting at 60% of your effort. Scrape it. Pull it back. Thirty seconds. Hey, 20 seconds. Scrape it. Scrape it. And five seconds. Hey, pull it up. Pull it up. Get the core tight. Use these muscles. Not the knees. Use these muscles. Pull it up. Pull it up. Pull it up. Come on, you can do it. Pull it up. Thirty seconds. Focus here, focus here. Pull it up, pull it up. Fifteen. Five seconds. Get ready. Push down. Push down. Keep your cadence up. Keep your cadence up. Push down. Push down. Push it down. Maybe bring the heel down. 30 seconds. Twenty. 
15. Push it down. Push it down. Get ready to stand up. And bring it up. Big circle. Big circle. Work that circle. The one leg helping the other. Keep it flowing. One constant circle. That's it, keep it going. One circle. Work together. Twenty seconds. Work that circle. Equal power. Equal rotation. Bring it down. And big circle. Big circle. Scraping. Pulling up. Pushing. Work that wheel all the way around, all the way around. Make sure your cadence is up. 85 to 90. Your wattage, 60% effort. 6 out of 10. Um, you got 30 seconds to go. Work it. Big circle, big rotation. Right, 10 seconds. Big circle. And relax it. Relax it. There we go. Okay, well done. So this was 30 minutes. Only a half an hour training session. But it's excellent. You can increase it, make it longer, but it's to activate the muscle, to think about scraping, getting those muscles to work, then pulling, getting this core, these muscles around the hip to work, then pushing, pushing down on the pedals. It's going to do awesome. It's going to do awesome work for you while you're in the bunch, when you're riding alone. You want to get that cadence and that speed up on your pedals and you want to go flat on a constant pace for endurance TT style or if you want to climb that hill you can vary these techniques they are awesome they are excellent for each muscle group so you can carry on with me and cool down or you can carry on do your own exercise or keep on riding. I'm going to cool down for another 10 minutes. Uh, you're welcome just to cool down with me but I'm gonna end it shortly so that you've got your own time your own cooling time I'm glad you chose the video today uh, go and uh, like the videos see with which other groups I ride trying to promote a few groups there's some excellent people out there some wonderful cyclists mountain bikers, road cyclists, triathletes, there are some excellent people out there. Join those that encourage you, join those that make you feel safe, join those that will protect you while you ride. You don't want to go out alone, always try and ride with somebody, at least to ride in a safe area.
Thanks for choosing Cycle with Emil and I hope you'll follow some of the other videos and I'll see you soon. Cheers. Thank you for sticking around with me and training again with me. I hope you're uh, enjoying the training and it's benefiting you. Now just stay with me a few more seconds as I read a scripture out of Romans. Romans 10 verse 14. But how can they call on him to save them unless they believe in him? And how can they believe in him if they've never heard about him? And how can they hear about him unless someone tells them? And how will anyone go and tell them without being sent? That is why the scriptures say how beautiful are the feet of the messengers who bring good news. Romans 10 verse 9 is a very important message. It says, If you openly declare that Jesus is the Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. For it is by believing in your heart that you are made right with God and it's by openly declaring your faith that you are saved. As the scriptures tell us, us anyone who trusts in him will never be disgraced. Jew and Gentile are the same in this respect. They have the same Lord who gives generously to all who call on him. For everyone who calls on the Lord Jesus will be saved. Thank you for staying with me. Have a blessed week. See you on the next training session. Enjoy.